loving it. We're loving it. It's an amazing event. Um, when I came across it, I was just excited that there's something like this happening for women in Toronto. The minute you walked in, it already set a tone and a theme. We're all looking for that work-life balance. What stops us from really living an inspired life? Because, you know, like once you've read self-help, and if it's not working, like where do you go next? Some wonderful women who have found ways to empower their lives. If you can see it, I really believe that you can achieve it. First is a vision, the second is taking action. We're having a great time, it's a wonderful atmosphere, and there's great energy here, it's lovely. It's incredible when you put lean fuel in your body, what can happen to you. Once you start making those changes to your body, it's like putting high quality gas in a jag. It loves to run. Every time I eat something now, I'm going to think of that and it's going to make me make a more knowledgeable decision of what I'm putting into my body. Garbage in, garbage out, okay? So you, you are what you put in and we all heard the phrase, you are what you eat. There's no gift you can give yourself or others around you better than taking care of yourself and doing a cleanse. I'd be more motivated to actually start making some changes that I know I need to make in my life. You know that you change your life in one place, it expands everywhere else. So you've got to get committed to having something move. I always say we have to disrupt the pattern of your life to have it then become something different. It's so motivational to get a kickstart in changing your lifestyle. It's been very empowering and I think it sets the tone for, I think, the rest of your day and the rest of your life.